Hi friends, in this video we are going to see how to convert an image of any format to PNG with transparent background. So let's assume you have a BMB image. Okay. Uh, it's a okay, it's an house image with a lawn in the background. So what we have to do is first let's drag and put this image in the PowerPoint. Okay. And if you want to convert into the PNG, so first thing like uh, there is an option to uh, save image and you can you know, directly select this as a PNG format and let's name as test1.png. Okay, So this will convert the BMB into a PNG format. So but the problem is like the background is still there. So it's not a transparent background. So how we can do? Oh, you know in the png normally we expect a transparent background so so we can use a feature called remove background in the powerpoint so it is available under picture format if you click the picture format you have an option called remove background okay so the pink highlighted regions will be removed okay so the uh, so, uh, so uh, we can you know so for example here the length, uh, legs are high and the tails are highlighted as like it will be removed so we can mark the areas to remove and mark the areas to keep okay first let's see uh, mark the areas to keep so we need this leg part okay and here okay this toe and this leg okay let's Let's do it proper this area okay. maybe we can zoom a bit okay, here we have this zoom option now let's mark the areas to be removed maybe this keep changes yeah so now we have removed the background okay after removing the background again do the same thing right click save as image select as a png format oh, let's test two okay let's see how it looks now yeah background is removed and maybe uh, this portion we have to remove it perfectly but still like a little it's a transparent background image so let, let's see how how it looks like when we uh, you know uh, place this image on top of some background okay, so let's do a slight flip and resize okay so we can we can use anywhere as a normal png file please do subscribe and add your questions in the comment section